SFA, this is GF Lazable from GamerFusion.com, and to what is going on, everybody? I hope everybody's having fun within the division, and like always, guys, trying to look out for you guys and show you guys the new stuff I found within the division. Today, I'm going to show you how to re-roll gear. Yes, guys, how to re-roll gear. As you guys know, if you guys come from Destiny, it's pretty much how you reforge or re-roll weapons, but this one doesn't allow you to actually re-roll weapons. It only allows you to re-roll gear. Now, as you know, gear is very very important for you to uh to have because you could either build a tank class you could either build a support class or you could build an intel class so what you're going to want to do is you're going to go to the security wing and you're going to want to have to have at least 200 credits for your tech wing stat you're going to go all the way down to the bottom and go to the recalibration upgrade if you notice on the right hand side it has a perk reward it says stat switch unlock items stats switch at recalibration station so that means there's going to be not only a station that opens up but also giving you the advantage of to recalibrate items so we're going to have hit click x to upgrade that and as you guys see it right there we have already upgraded it and now it tells us we have these abilities so once we have these abilities on the left hand side you're going to notice this station that opens up which is the recalibration station real happy designated area for repairing repurposing and refurbishing gear and weapons you can go crazy in there all right so pretty much this one says the recalibration station allows you to modify bonuses and attributes to your gear in exchange for some currency you will be able to exchange one property of a gear piece with another random property once an item has been recalibrated only the modif modified property can be changed again at a higher cost with each try so let's go ahead and see what we have here so let's see we want to recalibrate calibrate um, our we're gonna go with our chest piece and for example right now if you guys notice um, two things I want you to notice not only how many credits it costs to recalibrate this one costs 10,500 credits if I do a blue one it's a lot lot cheaper a thousand four hundred and seventy five credits so if I do a green one it's only six hundred and sixty six credits now one thing I do want you guys to know to notice is uh, on the right hand side it tells you exactly what you currently have and it also gives you a option to uh, see what you could recalibrate it to so for example let's uh, take let's take the chess piece again so if you guys notice it gives me different uh, different types of things I could get so for example right now I have 115 stamina right and it has 5 plus damage effect 7 plus proficiency so this one right here if I select the one on the right and it's gonna tell me what do you want to roll your what do you want to roll it to so I could pick what I want so uh, for purposes let's say I want to I want to go ahead and do the stamina I want to do all these right I guess gets to pick one of the two so it gives me different types of outcomes for that individual one but once I go ahead and do that it will go ahead and re-roll that and once that's re-rolled it will give me a random one so we're gonna, for for just for you know video purposes we're gonna re-roll this one so as you guys notice right now I have plus 44 in firearm that's what I have but if I want to go ahead and add an increase of XP or small cover duration I could go ahead and click that and once I click that it's gonna allow me to re-roll this part or if I want to go ahead and upgrade my firearm to a higher plus so I could either go from 39 to 47 in stamina and electronics and all that stuff so let's go ahead and re-roll this attribute right now I'm re-rolling and bam it is re-rolled and as you see now my an increase my stamina went 44 plus 4 increase in KD uh, in XP plus 3.50 percent in smart cover now I could go ahead and then re-roll again if I wanted to and select that and it will go ahead and says if you see this confirm new attribute plus 44 fire will be replaced with 42 stamina are you sure so it gives me the advantage of re-rolling that weapon now keep in mind that once you get higher level gear not only is it going to cost more but it's also going to be more less beneficial in the sense of uh, of uh, you being able to uh, to do that so for example let's say whoops wrong button let's say you want to do high level gear let's say we're doing um let's go back over here hold on how did i get back over there no i don't want to come i want to confirm attribute okay so let's say we we go back and uh, we want to go ahead and uh, level the legendary one it's going to give us a higher cost now if you have an exotic one or the yellow one you know the exotic high-end piece then that piece not only is it going to require you credits but it's also going to require phoenix 
Phoenix credits. If you guys don't know what Phoenix credits are, these are new. There's like certain currency for specific high-end level items. So that's going to be the difference between legendary, blues, greens, and whites. As you guys notice, the money's the difference, but also once you get to the exotic realm, you're going to have to pay Phoenix credits. Now, one thing I do want you to keep in mind, this is not only, this is just only for gear, no specific weapons, which is kind of cool because if you're trying to build a tank class or you're trying to build a class that actually works better for you guys, depending on what type of build you want to have, if you want to have a lot of DPS, like if you want to be like the damage type and you want to have, you know, match your primary DPS and your health, pretty much your firearms and your stamina, then you're going to have to work on building the right gear for that specific class. Now, if you want to max out your skill power and your health, you're going to have to find the gear that works primarily for that specific class. So that's, there you have it, guys. That is how you go ahead and reforge or re-roll your gear. Let me know if this video was helpful, and if it was, make sure you guys share it with your friends so they can know also how to re-roll weapons and what do they need to do to unlock. And don't forget, guys, for all things of Division, head over to GamerFusion.com, where we empower your game.